Hi everyone, finally it's warm enough to do some work outside. I will be very busy next week to transplant my tomato seedlings. So before that, I'd like to take a couple of days to do, to do some uh, building work. But this is my second greenhouse. It took me about three months to build it to this stage. Now you can see uh, the outer layer trusses are installed. The top window is installed. Some motors are mounted. The back wall, the frame is installed. But today, uh, I'm installing the inner trusses. Till this stage, 90% of the work was done by myself. I only need a, a guy to hold the outer layer trusses when I weld them because I need them to be vertical. Other than that, it was all done by myself. It may sound crazy that uh, one guy for uh, such a big commercial size greenhouse, well, I have no choice because uh, my budget is really limited. Trying to save every, every penny to finish two greenhouses here. So today let me show you how I'm uh, installing the inner trusses just by myself. Okay, I just uh, dug out the inner truss from the snow. Now I'm gonna climb up there to lift the one side of the truss with just a small tool, a pulley. Now all that end is uh, up top, now we can install the other end, but before I do that, please promise me, don't copy me, this is a pretty dangerous operation. Okay. There is so much snow. to dig more just for you to be able to see it what's down there okay I think you should be able to see it we don't have a concrete foundation but we have a base this is a steel angle at the base and on top of the steel angle, there is a anchor. So I installed this uh, 
uh, inner truss on the anchor with the bolt. Okay. Now I can weld the other side, the other end, on top of the ladder.
Okay, now one truss is finished. Uh, I just need to copy this operation all the way to the other side of the greenhouse to install all the inner trusses.